Hello, everybody, and welcome back to my channel. I've been new here. My name is Stormy Starbird. Why am I in a pool today? That's a very good question. That's a very good question. That leads me into the next part of this video. What are we doing today? So, I hit my knee on the little step. As you guys saw by the title of today's video, we are doing a game of life as a Vegas girly cop. A solo Vegas girly cop. Because I think it's so important to show you guys that you can have fun on your own, even when you are a person like me who absolutely, their mental health just absolutely tanks when they are alone. So, I'm going to show you basically just what I do in my day, my life. Oh my god, if you guys could go give me a follow on my socials, I'm um, Tiana, let's do something crazy. Viva Las Vegas! Viva! Viva Las Vegas! <laughs> um, so yeah, if you guys could go give me a follow on my socials there, and yeah, um, what is on the agenda for today? So typically, I start off my day, I come to the pool, and I just kind of chill, I get some work done, I like to do a little tanning and stuff, and typically right after, I would go to the gym, but I'm having problems restarting my gym membership, and so I haven't been able to go to the gym yet, so we're not gonna do that. I've been trying to decide if we wanna go to the club tonight, or if we want to go like play bingo or something. I'd been to a bingo, to a bingo like before at a casino with my friend, but I was really drunk on margaritas, and then they asked to leave, because I kept laughing. And so my mom took me when she, when we first came out here, she took me to a bingo night, and it was actually way fun. Like we go to this little place and there's just like a bunch of old people and they're a vibe to hang out with. And so maybe we'll do that tonight because I actually really enjoy that. It's like literally so fucking intense. Like you would not think bingo is intense. Let me tell you, like the old people were having to help me through this. It, it was so hard. It was so freaking hard because they call out these numbers like so fast. And I always thought bingo was like, you know, you just have to like line up the lines. It's not. Like they literally have like different shapes, different patterns, and like all different types of things you have to do. And like you hardly have any idea what's going on because they call it out like, like game five, you cross this, blah, 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 blah. And you're just like, what? And, and so yeah, I might, actually let's go do that. Um, yeah. What's up guys? How you doing? How you doing? Talk to me. Talk to me because I have nobody else to talk to and I'm losing my mindy mind out here. I'm losing my little marbles, my little marble marbles. You guys like my bikini? It's really cute. It's sparkly. Do you guys wanna play mermaids? You wanna play mermaids with me? I think you can get like really fast super speed. Or I guess if we're going H2 Ocean style, like you can like freeze shit or you can like melt shit. Um, I'll probably take like the fire one because I'm in Aries. And then we gotta choose our mermaid names. Um, I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be. What's a good mermaid name? I don't know what a mermaid name is. I don't know, clear. I'll be clear. It's not a mermaid name, that's just her real people name, but I'm gonna use that one as my mermaid name. Um, you guys can be like, um, like Diamond Sparkle or something, okay? Hey guys, <laughs> I actually don't know how to swim. Hey guys. So, fun fact about um, me as a mermaid and as a human. Um, I don't actually really know how to swim. I can kind of doggy paddle, but I actually don't know how to swim. Like when we went to Hawaii, I had to wear a little life floaty thingy, um, so I didn't die. I can do like a little doggy paddle and like keep my head up, but then I get really tired and then um, I guess I just drown. Okay, so I am just drying off right now. I have a mole that itches. Is that cancer? Am I gonna die? It just started itching. And now I'm scared to look it up on Google. So if I look it up on Google, I'm definitely gonna think I'm dying. Found this little squirt gun. Found this little squirt gun. Died. Ah! Died, died, died. I don't want to squirt my actual phone because that would get you guys all wet and I didn't get your permission to get you all wet. That's what she said. <laughs> but I'm all dried it off. So now it is time to head back and get showered off and continue on with our day. So I am stuck. I cannot get out. Um, the door is somehow locked from the in outside. And I don't know how to get out. I don't know how to get out. I can't get the door open. Oh my god, it, I'm overheating. Oh my god. I can't. It's literally locked. I don't know what to do. So that was like low key terrifying. I thought I was going to be stuck in there. And luckily, right as I was thinking, like, oh my god, I'm going to be stuck. I and there's nobody around. I was like, oh my God, I wish there was somebody around. Literally a lady started walking by and walked to her car. I'm like, hey, can you help me? So universe had my back on that one. I was getting literally so scared because guys, it's so hot out. So you can see how red my face is. It's 100 and I think it was like 111, 112 degrees. Um, and I really needed to get inside because I was getting really hot. She as hard as I could and I couldn't get out. And I was like, like this is gonna have to be unlocked and open from the inside. Cause you can't even, they have all these bars up. So you can't just stick your arm in and like do the key yourself. Somebody from the outside has to do the key. And I guess it just malfunctioned or something. And luckily, the universe had my back and a lady was walking and she's like, here, just slide me your key. Like I was like trying to slide it through the cracks so she could get it unlocked from the outside. And uh, it's really hot. I'm gonna go take a shower and cool off. Oh my God. All showered off, we are all showered off. But I just wanted to show you guys. I think this is why people hate me. 
I think this is like I am such a messy ass person and like don't Ooh. even get me started on the closet too like it's just oh my god because I change outfits so many times a day it's a mess it's a mess out here this just says I'm just a girl and then I mean like the seating area I never come over here because this is my filming area so clearly you can tell what I prioritize in my home so great news Instead of doing a workout, um, I thought I'd do something much more productive and I thought I would eat this piece of cold pizza in bed while I watch Trailer Park Boys. I think I'm just gonna sit here in bed rot instead. Now the pizza has been consumed, the Trailer Park Boys have been watched, and you know what? I did so good, I think I deserve a nap. I think this is what depression actually is. Like, low-key, I am so depressed during the days or whatever. Like, when I'm not going out at night, like, with whoever or whatever. Like, I'm just so fucking depressed just trying to get through my life. What is going on right here? Ow! <laughs> I dropped you guys again. Are you okay? Are you okay? Are you alright? I'm always dropping you. I'm so sorry. You got some brain damage. You got some brain damage now, but that just means you're just like me. I'm gonna go take a nap. I was gonna get ready, but I just got the urge to tint my eyebrows. I hate looking like an egg. I hate looking like an egg. So I actually don't like wearing makeup like 24 seven because it's just really bad for my skin. Um, I have really sensitive skin, so I break out really easy. But I have been wearing it a lot more lately because ever since I dyed my hair darker, my eyebrows have been so much fucking lighter that I look like a literal fucking egg. I think I'm about to do something I might regret. Do you guys wanna do it with me? Do you wanna do it with me? Let's go to the store. I just got out of the store. I found this shit. I saw the girl, I was looking up TikToks on how to do this. And this is what a bunch of girls were using. It's this um, just for men mustache and beard. Um, but they were using it on their eyebrows. Maybe it will match. <laughs> and let's go home and see if I ruin my eyebrows. Oh my God, I have fucking eyebrows again. What the fuck? Oh my God, okay, I'm so much happier now. I feel like I cannot wear makeup now. Is it perfect? Uh, no, did I get it all over my skin? Uh, yeah. But oh my God, I have brows again. If any of you are questioning if you should do this or not, you should absolutely do this. You should 100% absolutely do this. I didn't even know what the fuck I was doing, but thank you God, oh my God. Okay, so I just pulled my hair back cause like, I don't know, I just wasn't feeling it. I wasn't feeling it, so I pulled my hair back. Um, I'm just wearing something super casual today cause like, I'm just going to play bingo with some oldies. So now it is, it's the time for the makeup time. It's the time for the makeup time. So let's go do that. Oh, here we go. Manifestation song. TikTok also told me to be listening to manifestation music from now until the 8th because Mercury is retrograding again and it's a good time for manifestation or some shit. Manifestation goes like my ass, yeah, sure. complicated. I'll turn up. Feeling the way I feel, like I walk down the aisle. Dude, I had to use so little brow product. That's awesome. Playing my song, you know I'm gonna be okay. Okay, so I have arrived to where um, I'm going to be playing bingo. I'm in a place called Sam's Town, and it's really fun. It's really fun. It's like a little, like, western -y place. And there's, like, a little place where you can watch a waterfall show thingy. And it's really pretty, and it's really magical. The girl had some time, so, of course, I stopped to get myself a little sweet treat. A little sweet treat. Oh, my God, a little cup of it in. I haven't eaten yet today. I haven't eaten any meals. Like, I feel like I'm always snacking. So in Vegas, I feel like I never eat any meals. Just because it's so hot, I, it, like, meals are just too heavy. So I'm always just eating like little snacks to like get through the day, but it works for me. It works. My ice cream's already melting, so I need my ice cream. I need to put it into a cup. But we're here. I wanted to show you guys how pretty this place is. Wow. It's beautiful. And this is where the little waterfall show is. And I'm gonna take you guys over because I need to switch my ice cream to a cup um, before it gets all melted. The waterfall show is so pretty. They do it right here. I'll show you guys where I sat last night. I got ice cream on my face. <laughs> no, it's all going so wrong. I got ice cream and a waterfall. Yay! So I did have to de cone my ice cream. It's in a cup right now. I don't want to waste the cone though, so I'm making myself eat it. I didn't want it in a cone, I asked for it in a cup. But that's it for like kind of walking around. I do need to get up to bingo. I need to find the elevator. I need to get upstairs so I can get to bingo and get a little place before they start. So I didn't know it was only cash. It was only cash, so I need to get cash. They told me we're not eating this though, so we're gonna go to this little ATM. I am kind of worried about putting my card in here. I don't know if this is the smartest idea, actually. 
I don't know, my brother like freaked me out about putting my cards into like places in Vegas because like they can steal your shit. There's actually um, a little waterfall show at like 7. I'm gonna go check the times on that and maybe we'll just watch the waterfall show instead so I don't need to like put my card in. Might be better. Well, fuck me royally. Honestly, I should have seen that coming. Should have seen that one coming. Had to open my big old mouth and say that's what I was gonna go and do. That's okay. That's all right. So I don't think I'm gonna play bingo tonight though because I don't need cash on me, and I'm not really too down to put my card in the ATM um, because that's like my entire life on there. So yeah, we're not gonna do that. We're not gonna do that. Should we go get dinner? I haven't eaten yet today. I mean, I have ice cream, but like, I'm gonna eat real food. No, I don't really want to actually talk to anybody, actually. I kind of want to go home. This is also part of a day in my life, is when everything stops working out and I get anxiety and I need to go rot in bed for a minute. So we're gonna go do that. All right, so we'll just pretend I played bingo. We'll just play pretendsies. Wasn't that so fun? Oh my God, I can't believe we won. It was so easy too, oh my God. Oh my God, there's like a little sunlight, it's like tink. Okay, everybody, so that will be the end of a day in a life with me. Um, kind of a chill day because I didn't really want to go to the clubbing because you guys already saw the clubs. Uh, bingo didn't work out. But, you know, that's just kind of what I do. I just kind of side quest throughout my day. I get up, I go chill, usually go to the gym, um, do my work, and then um, just side quest it from there with really whatever I want to do for the day. So, yeah, it's pretty simple. Pretty fucking simple. Not much to my life. Anyway, <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching another video. I will see you guys in the next one. Make sure you like, subscribe, turn on your notifications, put on a new video, everybody. I love you guys so much. Make sure you go follow me on socials, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye, guys. Meeting people and TikTok tells me that everything about me is not unique and my entire personality is pretty much just being a girl with certain mental disorders.